Hello, my name is Jamal Sterling. I'm a junior players teaching artist with Dallas ISD, and today I'm here to teach you how an actor moves on stage. Let's look inside our actor's backpack. Alpad. What could I? Oh, I get it. So in the front of this iPad, there's a compass. And a compass teaches you what direction you're going in, right? If you take a compass, it'll tell you which way you're going. Like if you're lost in the forest, you had a compass to tell you you can go to west, east, or south. Well, for an actor, when an actor is moving on stage, they also have a compass. Their compass is called stage directions. Now stage directions can be in the script or stage directions can be supplied by the director. So today, we're gonna learn about how to move around on stage as an actor. Let's take a look at our stage. So ladies and gentlemen, this will be our stage for today, and I'm gonna stand center stage. Now as I was saying before, stage directions lead actors around the stage, okay? So the way we know how to move on stage is because the stage is separated into nine areas. They're called acting areas, okay? The acting areas. This lets an actor know where they need to move on stage. So let's learn about the nine acting areas. The first acting area, I'm standing right there, it is center stage. Center stage is the middle of the stage. So right now I am standing center stage. Now, if I was going to take a few steps back, I'm now upstage, all right? So upstage is away from the audience. So if you're going away from the audience, you're moving upstage. And if I'm walking towards the audience, I'm walking down stage. So upstage, away from the audience, downstage is towards the audience. So a long time ago, when a lot of stages were first being built, stages were built like a slight ramp. You know a ramp, a ramp has an angle to it, okay? So on this ramp, downstage would have been down, and upstage would have been up. So that's where we got the phrase downstage and upstage because downstage was the bottom of the ramp and upstage was at the top of the ramp, okay? So when you walked upstage, you actually walked up a ramp like you were going up the stage. Now they flattened out audiences since then and now stages are pretty much flat, but we still keep the terminology upstage, downstage, okay? Next. We need to know our stage directions. So, I'm back to the stage. That way is my right. I'm the actor, and the actor's right is stage right. It's always from the actor's perspective facing the audience. So right is stage right, and left from the actor facing the audience is stage left. Real simple, okay? So if you're standing on stage facing the audience, I told you to go to the right, you would go which way? That way, good job. And if you're on stage facing the audience and I told you to go left, you would go that way. Good job, good job. Okay, so now let's talk about the nine individual acting areas. So the first one is where I'm standing right now, center stage, okay? And if I moved upstage, that now becomes upstage center, okay? Center stage. Now, if I move back downstage, what do you think we call it? You got it right. Downstage center. Good job, good job. So downstage center, center stage, upstage center. Can anybody guess what this spot right here be? Good job. Stage right or right stage, okay? And if I moved upstage, I would now be upstage right. Very good. If I move downstage, I would then be downstage right. Good job, good job. So now, using our common sense, we're gonna travel over to the other side of the stage. What side of the stage is this? Stage left, you got it right, very good. So, stage left, if I move a few steps behind me, 
up stage left, and down stage left. Thank you, thank you, good job, good job, good job. So those are the nine acting areas. Down stage left, stage left, up stage left, up stage center, center stage, down stage center, down stage right, stage right, up stage right. Now the acting areas are where you stand on stage. We're gonna go over the body positions now. And the body positions are how you stand on stage. So right now, I'm standing facing the audience. We call this full front. Everybody say full front. Good job. If I turn my back to the audience, what do you think this would be called? Correct, full back. So full front means the full front of you is facing the audience. Full back means the full back of you is facing the audience. Excellent job, excellent job, excellent job. So now we're gonna do like a clock because the body positions look like the clock. And we're gonna go over each body position real quick. If you angle your feet a little bit to the right, it's called one quarter right or one fourth right. One quarter right, good job. Take another, move on the clock, and now you're facing directly to the right. We call this profile right. Profile right. Next, our bodies turn three quarters away from the audience. So now we are three quarters right. You guys remember this one, full back. Very good. Three quarters left, which means you're three quarters away from the audience to the left. Profile left. One quarter left. And finally, full front. Now the reason we use the body positions is real simple. When we have an audience, you wanna make sure that everybody in the audience can see you, okay? So if you stand at one quarter right and your scene partner stands at one quarter left, you both could see each other and the audience can see your faces. So if your mom is sitting way over there, if you're angled out this way, she can still see your face when she comes to see you star on the big show, okay? So that's how we use the body positions to make sure we are opened up to the audience and can be seen by everyone. So, real quick, a game I like to play is called Simon Says, but instead, it's body position Simon Says. I'll say Simon Says in a body position, and you have to do the body position. Now, I have to say Simon Says. If I don't say Simon Says, you gotta sit down, you're out, okay? So, let's try it easy. Simon Says, full front. Gotcha, full front, you got it. Everybody got it right, good job. Now, full back. I did not say Simon Says, turn around, turn around. <laughs> good job, all right. Let's do a hard one. Simon Says, one quarter right. Good job, good job. Now Simon says one quarter left. Ah, you guys have figured it out, very good. All right, full back. Good job, I didn't say Simon says, so no full back. So ladies and gentlemen, that is how an actor moves around on stage. My name is Jamal Sterling. Thank you so much for coming to see us at the Actors Backpack. I can't wait to see you again next time.